Motor the Vampire here. Welcome back to Motor Let's Play Terrible Rise. Last time we just got a call. We witnessed, unfortunately, the death of Law's father, Zephyr. Died, unfortunately. God, the rest of soul. And I feel sad about it. And, uh, of course, we need our way to the tower going after Candlebelt. So, that's what we're doing today in this video. If you like everything you saw here, click the like button, subscribe, and of course, click the bell icon with all notifications enabled so that way you stay updated. Uh, you can stay up to date with everything. I do live streamings, uh, anime recommendation videos, anime reviews, uh, video game gameplays, and others. Alright, so let us get started. Striving to be on par with the Lord? You simply can't be too strong when battle is a part of your every day. So let's see, I have been experimenting Go no further. with what the Lord in the enemy one I can do this for. So, for example, it's called the Fulfill Under the Water, which actually follows the game timeline before uh, the third one. So if you never actually played the rest of the game, I highly recommend you play it. Actually, I'm gonna redo a let's play for that one. I know back on Cosine 23, I did do it, but there were some issues. So I'll plan on doing that. Uh, I'll plan on doing that in the future. That's all we need. That's all. all right. On we we'll go to the next area. Don't need to worry about going to other places. Looks like they're more for decorative purposes than actual combat. Does it matter? We've got a job to do. Wait, this isn't Renan. It's Danon. Really? And not just this one either. All of these. It's all Danon gear. What's Danon equipment doing on display inside a Renan castle? Ask around later if you're so interested. But for now, we've got more pressing matters to attend to, remember? Remember? 
Oh yeah, that, that reminds me, I need to make, uh, I need to fix the thumbnails for all the, for all of the videos, because some of the reason, I don't know why, but I had to fix the titles for some of my past LP episodes for this. Back in guys. Alright, guys, here we are. This is where, uh, so I kind of accidentally, uh, accidentally, uh, jumped ahead. So you're supposed to talk to the guy first, then you're supposed to go and find the key on the first floor, then come up here. So I, I made that mistake. This open the door? We still don't know how to activate the elevator. We just have to see what we can figure out. That bastard! Give it us the run around! singing so can I whistle no can I hum it all right yes I know I was just making a Shrek reference which is actually a really really good uh really really good uh animated movie back in the day so those who didn't grow up in uh in the early to late 2000s. That was one of the really, really good anim animated films by, uh, what's his, uh, by DreamWorks. They were really, really good back in the day. Such a shame. Such a shame. These ones can return to the world. Are you going? We have no energy. Do it. Move down. This ends now. Consider yourself finished. Oh, that. Our work is done here. Let's move. I'm right behind you, Shion. 
Does this look like an elevator key to you guys? Only one way to find out. Let's go. They keep a Zuga locked up down here? Why? I've heard rumors that they feed prisoners to one instead of executing them. Do you think... Stop it! Alright. Still thinking about that armory with all the Danon equipment? Yeah, especially that black armor. I don't think I've ever seen anything from Dana that looked so nice. I can tell you that it was definitely Danon. It was made using techniques found only here. That's how I know. But ever since the Renans came, our civilization's been scrubbed out bit by bit. Hardly anything's left now. Which is why most people don't remember. But why would the Renans have something like that? Unless it was the spoils of war. It must be a token of the Danans who fought and lost in the past. Or rather that the Renans were able to beat them. Armor that nice must have been worn by a commander of some sort. They might have even been a Danan hero. A hero, huh? A fallen hero, maybe. I hate to see all that stuff fall into Renan hands, but it's amazing to see that so much of it has survived. You into this kind of stuff then, Rinwell? Uh, I mean, yeah, I guess. Are we done here? We don't want to keep Ganabelt waiting any longer. to be talking about shoving in politics. Politics don't, don't fit. Not to mention I actually really hate politics. With a passion. It's all just people just bickering about Go no further. Right there. What is the whole point of learning over a single country or even over the entire world if no one can come to an understanding and come to you putting their differences in time and putting them together? You know, we're all human and we all have to learn we do and strength. And you know what? Humans themselves created many Certainly different not things. Bad. No complaints you know, here. We created, you know, houses. We create tools. We create all sorts of things. So, why in the world would one just, you know, argue about such a thing? Yeah, it makes no sense. As uh, 
You have King Growly once said, you know, if you wish to see me destroyed for all these atrocities, use your own hands to do it, not God's. And besides, you know, you know, God is nothing more than a mythos by the end of the most order. I need to be stronger. Why should you care about about her opinions and politics? I don't care. She's a great author. She tells great stories. And you know what? I I'm I've already pre-ordered the game, so I'm gonna play it. And no matter what anybody says to me, I don't care. I plan to play the game, one way or another. Okay? Okay. 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 Okay.
considering that, like, you know, just these play here, the whole entire thing over and over again, with very different characters. But to make it over, like, over, you know, Right, so what? Like, who's gonna kill this guy? I'll crush you! Lightning reflexes! Ten of us Nice. That was really, really good. If only I could summon up a little bit or maybe even uh, summon up uh, what those are what those are creatures that I summon up. Uh, no wait, no, 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 Shiva, Shiva. Wait. No, she was probably 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 more than you would have it. Turbo? Maybe you were quiet on. I'm thinking about all the sorts of power fantasy characters that you could actually come in within the game. If you could. I don't know. Leave a comment about which uh, type of furry character you have to comment. Or maybe even. Ooh, Bahamut! Oh, Bahamut would be serious major damage. He really made I mean, his work he is for that a very one. OP, very overpowered creature. Right. You think the elevator's activated now? <laughs> Should be. Let's check and find out. We're coming for you, Genevieve! Don't need the force, you don't need to do a proxy, you're going to send back and you're going to waste some money. 
don't need any of that. Just waste the money. Don't, don't bother with your money on, on those things. So if a game is, is $60, that's, that's how much you're getting. Now, if you want to you know, make DLC, you add five dollars for DLC. It doesn't mean that for all. DLC is just this really, really small added on stuff to it. That's all I can it really, really even is. Stronger. Just a little farther and we'll be there. I'm coming for you. Get a belt. Alright. I'm going to call this an awesome episode. But let's play Tales of Arise. Join me in the next episode that we will finally take on Gandabout, save the realm, and then proceed on to the following one. Uh, which, the third one actually is actually really, really cool. It's a really, really cool realm. It's really like it's it's filled with nice, peaceful people, and the city itself is really, really nice. It's so beautiful, too. Although, I'm not just quite as beautiful as, um,. That's one gin ginormous city in uh Cold Steel in Erbonia. That one is uh I forget it's the it's the place where Translator Arsborn lives in. Oh my god, and Machias' father is the governor of that area too. And that is a really, really great area. And it's actually a lot cleaner compared to, you know, the Bay Area San Francisco in, here in California. It's not it's not quite as nice. I mean it's cold most of the time. Maybe like 30% of the time it's warm, but most of the time it's cold because I mean it's near the it's near the water and it's close to the water, plus it's surrounded by a lot of hills and such, and a lot of tall buildings. And you can get lost in there pretty easily, and plus not to mention traffic in that area is so terrible. Even when you're on the freeway traveling over into downtown San Francisco, it's horrible. But, you know, with the thing in Erebonia, that ginormous place, forget what it's called now, but it's really, really cool. And I actually love some, some of the shops and stuff that you get to do there. If only that was what San Francisco could be like. Well, it's not really like some of the, some of the areas are also really, really cool. Even the trams are so nice too. Even that the even that uh, music had to be placed in that car is also really cool. Anyways, so yes, join me in the next episode of the Real Tech and Candy Belt. And of course, if you love if you love everything that you saw in this episode, give it a like, comment down below, share of course, hit the subscribe button, bell icon, all notifications enabled, and be sure you guys come back on a on a daily basis. I upload videos almost every day, from anime and gaming runs, to Let's Play Tales of Scott and Nexus, and now debunked uh, Let's Play Jack and Dexter, to Tales of the Rise, to anime recommendations, manga recommendations, and others. And I'm still experimenting with more, with more new ideas for content, so come back as much as you can. And you know there are days where I don't upload content, I will always come back and upload content. Alright? So, with that, I like the endings up here. This is Kurei the Vampire, and this is from Anime Kurei D5. Take care, guys. Have a good day.